Is it just me or did Discord accidentally turn into a SaaS company for AI startups? Stay with me on this one. Discord was founded as a place for people to play games together, to communicate with friends in large group settings, basically like if Slack was cool. But now it seems like some of the hottest generative AI startups are building on top of Discord. Through Discord's offerings for app developers, companies like Vigil and Midjourney have become some of the most dominant on the platform, outputting thousands of AI generated images and videos in response to users' prompts every day. By using Discord, these Young companies can scale out to millions of users faster than if they just built their own infrastructure. Midjourney hosts the biggest server on Discord with over 20 million users, and according to CB Insights, Midjourney could be worth over $10 billion. And it's all running on a platform that was originally built to help people communicate with their League of Legends teammates. A newer company on Discord, Vigil, could be the next new big thing in generative AI. When it opened its server in March, it had a few thousand users, but now at the end of May, it has 3 million users. If you saw that meme based on Lil Yachty's walkout, that's Vigil. As founder Hong Chu told TechCrunch, we're focusing on building what we call the controllable video generation model. When we generate content, we wanna control precisely how the character moves or how the scene looks. We also talked to Discord's VP of product, Ben Schenken, about this unexpected twist in the company's trajectory. He told us, it's not easy for any type of company to scale, but Discord is built for that type of scale and we're able to help them absorb that pretty well. Even though the server for a new app like Vigil is bigger than the servers for League of Legends and Valorant combined, Discord still sees connecting groups of friends as its primary focus. But lending infrastructure to some of the biggest generative AI companies can't hurt. 